All you have to do is get to this station and let go of the steel. Leave it there. That is your duty, your task. Nope, he didn't do it. Hello, Internet, and welcome back to Open TTD. We're just here kind of watching our stretch of roadway. Our trucks are doing truck things. Buses are doing bus things. How much money are you making, Mr. Bus? Some. Good. This truck? How about you? Less. I think the issue with that is that the trucks, so that bus is on fire, he's on his way. I figured out the buses and trucks and whatnot, they just explode every so often and fix themselves. So it's just part of what they do, how they have fun. Uh, I think part of the reason these trucks are not so profitable is because they only carry coal to the plant. They aren't carrying anything the other way. So they're making money whenever they drop off here, but then all the drive back, they're losing money. But that's not a horrible thing, and I have an idea for that. What is this? Oh, that's a steel mill. Oh, really? Is the, that's a coal mine. I missed it. There was a steel mill there. Uh, hmm. If I had a plan, that might change it ever so slightly. Uh, nah, we'll kind of go with it. So, uh... I've done some looking around in the off time. Is this a mine? Oh, it is. So, we have this factory here. It needs steel, grain, and livestock. We have a market that produces grain and livestock. What we need is to get steel in there. Well, there are steel mills, and they need iron from the iron mine. And I was thinking, I was actually looking at these two. Don't go to sleep. Uh, down by 19. I couldn't quite read that. Uh, it's probably unimportant. So, we've got iron mine. We've got steel mill here. We've got a town. Two towns, technically. We've got weird, I guess that's a tree. This is a little sawmill. Uh, it's unimportant for now. I think that what we need is a train that takes the stuff from here, connects it into this, runs up past Cat Hill, up into Punwell, so it can stop off at this factory. I think I'm gonna build maybe some sort of freight interchange here at the factory. Because then... I can run up to this factory as well, and potentially even connect in some of these farms, but I don't know if that's going to be wise. Uh, yeah. And I can also, it'll have me have a train line running roughly this way, so I can connect in these three little towns and head on to New Sladhead, which is a major metropolitan area, uh, and that's an iron mine. What well, dang. The steel mill. Actually. Maybe what I do instead. What is this red thing? Uh, just another factory. They come in different colors, those. Yeah, what I may do. Okay, scratch what I just said. I'm going to run up here. I'm going to use maybe trucks to make the connections here, but run a train line from New Sladhead down to Punwell, making some money and things. Okay, so I guess let's start off. Uh, I don't have an insane amount of what would be called money. But it is going up ever so slightly every time things drop off, so that's good. Uh, train. I guess the first step... Is this a station? Yes. So first step is we need a station. 
Uh, mm, okay. So I can set number of tracks. Well, I think this one is going to be, maybe we'll put it on this side, but I think this station is going to be just an end station. Yeah, so it can just kind of have one track, length five, we'll just kind of slap it right there. Okay. Then we need another station. Uh, maybe we'll put this station kind of centrally. Yeah. Do I want to make some road for it? Yes, I think I do. Okay. So what we're going to do... Uh, we'll have it stretch a road right along there, please. Thank you. Then, track station. We'll have this one. Let's have three lines. Five length. That should be fine. Excuse me. Oh, it's hefty. Uh... Okay, two lines, five length. I'm getting a telegraph. Uh, service subsidy offered. Uh, from somewhere to Preston. Okay, so I guess that this little ticker down at the bottom lets me know various things it looks like. So, I guess the subsidies come as essentially rewards for doing things. That's lovely. Okay. Station right there. It's off the road. We can make a little bus line to connect that. Uh, and then we'll just run our track. So the reason I've done two stations there is that's going to be the combined new Sladwell station. Uh, it services the mine. I'll also have... Uh, well, I'll have to take from the mine to there. That should be fine, though. Uh, make a little road, do a little love, but, so I'll have one line coming out here that's for the freight, one will be the passenger platform, I assume these work for freight and passengers, hope so, so let's lay in our freight line first. Uh, oh, hold on. I've done a doof. So that goes literally as it shows straight up. Which is not what I want to do. I want like this, please, good sir. Uh, this is going to destroy someone's lovely home, but that's fine. Uh. Oh no, it can't. Okay, I have to do it for them. Radio. Does it make. I think it crossed the track. There's a tree there. Yep, already built. Okay. This is going good. We'll just run it straight on out. 7k. So the downside is this isn't super cheap. I think I'll wait on the passenger line. But... This should hopefully make me some cash, because it'll get a lot of these things interacting. Okay, so I need to go a little slanty fella up to there. The grid does make it nice and easy to tell what's happening. Uh, except I goofed it there. Away with you. One more there. Okay. So. Great. So I've got a line running from there. 
down to this goods factory. Oh no, I may have to tweak this a bit. Or no, I'll put the other station out here. Should have maybe put that in. Because I could actually share track for a chunk of this. Well, I don't know. Uh, okay. So we've got that. Next, I need to do a little bit of road working. Money. 377. 370. Money is going down. That's not the direction I like. That should be okay. Let's do a little road there. Okay, that's wrong. Still getting used to the, uh, how you make things connect to each other deal. Okay, that looks good. Let's do truck stop. Uh, there-ish. Okay, so that's at the mine there, and then... I don't know if I put, whoops. Okay, well that's built. Uh, we'll just build it like this. I'll stick it there. My hope is that this truck stop will serve the station and the mine. So then I can get from the mine, take it by truck over here, process it into the steel, and then when the trucks come back, they'll drop it off, and it'll be at the station ready for the train to take it down to the factory. It's okay. We'll slap our depot in right there as well. Okay. Oh, and I also need... Uh, right. Yeah, this isn't important. It's not going to look good yet. Okay. I realize I also need a connection for this farm to the factory to make anything good. Do I want to do that by road? Probably should do. Just because trains are so expensive. Okay, so we'll run that in there. A truck stop, please. And then... We'll just continue this road out. And maybe put in one of the road truck stops. Uh, there. Okay. So. We've got some setting up now to do. Oh, and I need a rail hub. Can I put these at a T-intersection? Don't know. Oh, sure. Trains don't care. Okay. So, first off, let's go to the Punwell Yard. We need new vehicle. Uh... Okay, what is it that we're transporting? So, they have grain and livestock. So... We need a livestock van and a grain truck. Okay. Is there a way to select them both and assign them their own stuff at once? Doesn't seem it. Uh, what is this one? You are livestock. I'm gonna just change this to Uh, let's do Punwell Livestock 1. Okay. I should start naming these so I can figure out what's what later. Uh, yeah, a few two orders, that's fine. I should 
pause while I do logistical setting up stuff, probably. Okay. So, Punwell Livestock 1, and then this is Punwell Rain 1. I want it to be a capital G. Okay. So, Livestock and Grain. Godspeed. I didn't actually set up their orders, did I? Nope. Okay. Well, that's fine. So you will go from there to there. Uh, yes. Good, good. And you... Same deal. Okay. Now you're good. Yeah, I guess they have orders, so they're on their way now. Okay. It's so not set up. Let's do now. A uh, new slad head, please. It's the mines. Give me the depot. There we go. So, new slad head. It's an oil tanker. I need like a ore truck. Dang it, and you have to have a separate steel truck. That's a bit of a pain. Because again, if they could do it both, I bet as you go, you get better vehicles that can do multiple things. That's probably what happens. Uh, so for now, we need an ore. Not allowed while paused. Ah, oh, I can't buy a vehicle while paused. That's a pain. Okay. Well, let's go back and... That's fine. I want to see these fellas engage in trucking activities. Look at them go. Okay, so they'll take some goods there, start stocking them up at the factory. We now... Yes. New Sladhead Depot. So, ore truck please, steel truck please. Okay, pause up again. Uh, let's see, you are a uh, ore truck, okay? Uh, slad. Or one, and you shall be slad iron one. Abbreviations will keep us sane these trying times. Okay, now. So, both of you go from there to there. Yes. There uh, to there. Yes away with you. Okay. Now they're moving. And now I just need uh Tatterboro Market Woods. I wonder where that is. Oh, that's the farm. Okay. Can I change the name of that? I can. Uh, ooh. call you farm. Mines make sense. This one should be Punwell Factory. And a lot of logisticking. But, all right, perfect. Okay. So, train. Now this is exciting. We've not done this yet. Yes, train depot please. New vehicle. Uh... Hmm. Right. First truck arrives at Punwell. So... Now one thing I don't know is what the goods are for. Because this factory produces goods. My assumption would be 
uh, that towns want those goods for themselves, but I've not been able to find anything that kind of indicates that. Well, click on new slad head. Town is not growing. Passengers mail. Coverage doesn't do much. Local authority. Yeah, they don't. There's not really much. Not really much going on that indicates to me how to sell things. So I'm just gonna assume that they're gonna create the goods and love them and cherish them in their own special way. So I'm just gonna bother, I'm just gonna slam a bunch of iron cars onto it. So we need a locomotive. These are all cars, okay. Uh, oh and they're facts and features. Okay. Well, we want just like a freight train, fella. What is this? Okay, so it costs 8k, 15k, 22k. We only got 30k, so I think we'll go with this one just by cost. My guess is that this is the basic cheap little guy. Is it... Oh yeah, so this is 381 kilonewtons of tractive effort. Uh, max speed 112. This one, max speed 64. 136. So it's not got a lot of oomph behind it, but we can always upgrade it later. Right now, we just want... Oh, right. Okay, time. You can go so my check can process. Okay. My vehicle and... So, I could do a goods car, but I don't know what that means. So we're just gonna go... It's iron ore... Steel car. Right. So, 18 tons... My train... I don't know what equates to what in terms of what it can pull. Someone with knowledge probably does, but I don't have that. We'll just buy five of these. I have a five long station. Does each of these count as a one? We'll buy five. Five looks, that that's a good looking train. Good train length. All right. So, train one. Uh, this will be the not iron train because it doesn't carry iron. Steel train. Steel train, I can't click here. Steel train one. Okay. You set tally forth from this station. To this station and back again. Away. Oh, there it goes. Unfortunately, there's not a good... I can't, like, follow it. Oh, I have a ton of room. Okay. First train arrives at Punnel Woods. So it's going to be running empty for the moment, but that's fine. Crossing the tracks, that's fun. Okay. Our money just jumped up a little bit, but it is going down, I believe. Yes. That makes sense, because we're expending money. Just gonna follow this little fella as he puffs along. Now, I don't know... You can see there's some sloping down of this terrain. So I don't know, there's probably some level of like efficient track laying and finding good flat paths that works better. It's like, this little thing doesn't seem to be very useful, does it? Uh, that probably affects how fast trains can move and all that jazz, but for now, doesn't seem too bothered. 
what is this? Uh, subsidy expired. That's fine, I didn't see it the first time. Now am I, okay, so, steel truck uh, is empty. Oh no, that's the iron truck. The steel truck is there soon. Okay, our train is in the station. Yes. Now, did it pick up any steel? Uh, there's some iron there. Hold on. Stop everything. Ah, steel train one. Empty, 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 empty. Well, that's fine. That's, that's, uh, perfectly okay. I'm sure it's just kind of balancing out. You know, gotta give these things time to settle in, get moving. Look at this, what do you haul? That's the iron ore. Uh, you. Nope, come on, give it to me. Fine, I'll pause again. Uh, oh no, that's, oh, I've just mislabeled them. So that's the steel. Hold on, what do you haul? So this is the ore. So it all's iron ore. You. What do you haul? Steel. It is empty. Okay, that's not ideal. Uh, well, let's rename you. Steel, so I won't get confused. Why is... Is our iron truck? It should be empty. Let's follow old Iron Buddy and see if we can figure out why it's not getting full. There's iron ore here. Maybe it's something, maybe there's just uh, not enough iron ore at the factory yet to produce more. Okay. Yes. Oh, look, it's filling. 100%. Yep. 22 tons of iron ore. Uh. Oh, it did produce steel. Hold on. Okay. Steel. Show me your info. Let's watch him roll up. Now, conceptually, you would need coal for this process as well, though it is so close by, it's not that big of a concern. Okay. Oh, he's loading. Well, in fact, look at that. There's steel on the back of his truck. Ah, look at you go. Uh, subsidy expired. That's fine by me. Okay, so once he arrives, we should have some steel here. Uh, I assume these are all purpose. Oh, so that shows the trains, right? Trucks. It says accepts passengers, mail, and goods. It's got a bunch of iron. Well, we'll see if steel appears here in a second. Nope. Why are you still driving around with the steel on your back? Uh... Okay. Is it possible that, like, this is full of iron? And can't hold any steel? Do these have, like, ratings? Monthly supply of iron. Mediocre. Okay. 
There's not like a different type of... Uh... very confused oh the trains exploded ever so slightly so you know when I put it here so it supplies passengers mail iron ore accepts passengers mail and goods the iron guy didn't drop off this is a confounding puzzle uh sure comments will come in telling me what I'm doing horribly horribly wrong yeah so he is chock-a-block full of steel he's on his way up yep, there in the real world view all you have to do is get to this station and let go of the steel leave it there that is your duty your task Nope, he didn't do it. Why are you... Is that not how... Do I need a second platform? There's a bunch of iron ore here. Hmm. Let me see... If I build a truck bay... We'll build it right here. Okay, hold on a moment. Yeah, yeah, I don't need expense reports. Uh, okay. Steel one. You, new orders. So. Oh, what is this called? So that's new sled head woods we want to keep. But, instead of this one. So, instead of the mines... You go from there, go to Latin, right? I don't know. Let's see what it does. Okay. Yeah, so he loads up. Takes the iron on down. You are full of iron already. Hmm. Very mysterious. Well, we're also about at time, so... I think maybe what I will do... We'll just kind of... Well, no, I kind of want to see him get there. Maybe if we... Accelerate just for a second. Oh, nope. A little more than a second. Yep. Okay. He didn't turn. Oh, because he's going into the bay. But he look, there he goes there. Why do you wish to drop off? All you have to do is leave the steel. Why do you do such things? Okay. Well, that's it for this episode, I think. Uh, I'm going to try and figure out what this fella's doing, and we'll come back next episode and see if I've done that. So, yeah. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Feel free to check out all the other stuff I've done. Until next week, bye-bye.